if this works and my iPhone doesn't fall onto my keyboard, it'll be a miracle. Okay, I'm moving the keyboard now. So it'll fall into my lap. There we go. Sort of. Hopefully, it won't fall. Okay, um, what I didn't talk about earlier was that Nancy had sent an email to my supervisor, our supervisor, Pauline, about this, um, getting the students to uh, sign their names when they uh, come to class. We don't just take attendance for the afternoon class. The students uh, last term were supposed to sign in. And um, it's like she didn't trust us, okay? And Nancy took this to heart and she was offended. And she says, basically, doesn't she trust us? Does she think we're fudging? And I said, yeah. <laughs> Maybe other people are fudging and they have to make a general, you know, uh, rule. And I thought that it was a general rule. Then um, this term started and nobody said anything, so I wasn't doing it and Nancy wasn't doing it. And we're in our second week now and um, Nancy asked Pauline and Pauline, yes, keep doing it. And Nancy um, sent an email to Pauline and said, don't you trust us? This is really, you know, offensive. She didn't quite say those things, but basically she said, you know, I'm the kind of person who just says what they think and this is what I think. It feels like you don't trust us because we're the only two people here in Cambridge that are getting asked to do this. No one else is. It's a fact. No one else was getting asked to um, write, get their students to write in. So, I didn't know that. I didn't know that. Um, Pauline has backpedaled like crazy because she talked to someone else and they said, hey, you can't do that. You can't just ask two teachers to do that and not ask the whole, the whole, uh, uh, ESL staff of St. Louis. So <laughs> she's backpedaling and she cannot actually ask us or any of us to do that. No. So that's good. My numbers are good and you know there's no issue where we would possibly need to fudge. I could have needed to fudge but I don't need to fudge and I don't fudge and I wouldn't want to fudge and you know Close my class, I'll do something else. <gasps> Freak. Julia, why are you sitting on my tray? Because it's an interesting place. She likes, she's, ever since it turned a little cooler, she's been on my lap as soon as the lap becomes available. So every breakfast, I have a cat in my lap. So, anyway, that's how it is at work now. All of a sudden, the numbers are good, but we don't need to keep track that way anyway. Offensive or not. Nancy does some good. She does some good. Just to let you know. <laughs>